What is up everybody? Welcome back to our Let's Play of Pokemon Fire Red. We are on part 6 now. In the last episode, if you remember, we uh, went through the boat, uh, the SSN, we got cut, we went through the Diglett Cave, we got Flash, and um, now we're headed east to go through the Rock Tunnel. And in the meantime, I went and found Meowth, who can learn Cut and Flash. So we got rid of Diglett, so we have Meowth as our HM slave. So now we're going to go ahead and just press onward. You have Pokemon with you, you're mine. Oh. Okay. He's a little aggressive. He's a picnicker. I see. Alicia. Alright. So the boys are campers and the girls are picnickers. Gotcha. Add up, babe. Good job, Firo. Oh, we got this on lock, baby. We got this on lock. I went ahead and, uh... Made some changes to this layout. Now there's a, a, a black border on the top and the bottom of the screen, so that way you don't see the the emulator stuff and uh, my toolbar. Little little tiny edit, but worth it. I think it looks good. Looks nice and clean. Boom! All right, Alicia. Thanks for all that XP. I appreciate it. And is this is this Aerial Ace? It is Aerial Ace. Firo just got that much more powerful. 60 damage and it never misses. It's got perfect accuracy. Pretty incredible. Oh, uh, let's get rid of Growl. One, two, and poof. Good job. Uh, let's go ahead and let's switch for Ivysaur. We've got a hiker right here. Hmm. Yes, you were bored. Well, allow me to fix that. Now you will be just depressed from losing. Oh, and he has a Machop. Great. We could have had Firo out. What is that, gonna be 20 damage? Yeah, so Seismic Toss, uh, Seismic Toss is a fixed move. Or the damage is fixed, so no matter what your level is, that's gonna be the damage you deal with that move. Pretty cool, but... You know, not, uh... Not something that I'd use. It's good for capturing Pokémon and stuff like that, but... I don't like fixed moves, for the most part. There's only... A handful that I think are useful. <sighs> oh wait, I'm out of Pokemon. Yes, you are. Nothing over here. Switch back to Firo. Who's that walking there with those good-looking Pokemon? They're in the Pokeball, how could you... How do you know what they look like? Hmm... Growlithe! Oh, I can't wait till we get Growlithe. We're getting close! We're getting close to Growlithe! Ba -na -na. Let's try out this Aerial Ace. Not bad. A critical hit, baby! Love it. Absolutely love it. Level 23, Firo. Charmander. We've got just the boy for you. Our Gyarados. Gai Gyarados. Gyarados. Water Pulse, let's go. 
Oh yeah. Do do do. Out like a light. That is that is a good uh what metaphor? Fero, you're still out in front, right? Good. I got up early every day to raise my Pokemon from cocoons. Ah, that's great. So we're gonna be dealing with what, Beedrill and Butterfree? Sure are. Nice. What are we gonna get, like 500 XP, 600? Almost 650. Oh, two Beedrill. I guess that makes sense. Kakuna. Cocoon. Yeah. What a total waste of time. Not for me. I can see why you'd feel that way, though. Oh, wow. There's an ether. I, I was not expecting there anything... Wow. I was not expecting anything to be there, but, uh... I'm glad we checked anyway. You're not gonna have much shop, are you? Bring it on! We gotta get our Firo nice and strong. We're gonna be relying on Firo for the next gym battle. However... We might be able to... Yeah, we should be able to get Growlithe beforehand, so maybe we will uh, rely on Growlithe. We'll see. Growlithe and Fira will be good to have for that next gym battle. Because she uses Grass-type. Thank you, Alan. Yeah, give me my money, bruh. Bruh. Burn heal. I keep forgetting we have a bike. I just like the way the, uh... I like the movement running. The camera doesn't move too fast. I don't know why camera, but whatever you call this. I think it just moves a little too fast. For my eyes. But I am playing this at night. Usually I play these in the morning or in the middle of the day. But it's probably more likely because it's... Uh, getting close to bedtime. I didn't- I didn't even switch to Firo. Well, good job. <laughs> but, yeah. My eyes are feeling heavy and I'm tired. So, I think that's what's bugging me. But, I felt like playing some Pokemon before bed. So, here we are. A Weedle. What are, you, what are you still doing with Caterpie and Weedle, bruh? You should have... Beedrill and Caterpie. Oh, okay. He's got a Venonat. Probably won't one-hit this. Oh, we did! Much respect, Firo. Much respect. Connor. You didn't do that great, buddy. I don't know how else to tell you. I'm taking the rock tunnel to go to Lavender. Lavender Town. And my, my puppy's chewing on the towel, so give me a quick moment. <laughs> Such a cutie. Gotta love the puppy life. Alright, took care of that. Ooh, Sandshrew. Okay. Nope, we're gonna stick with our boy Ivysaur. Because why not? He's doing great. It's super effective. 
Do -do 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 -do. Another sand shrew. And another razor leaf. Just like that. Whoops. Ekans. Hmm. Yeah, we'll just go ahead and use Dig. It'll be a one hit KO. Ah, yes, Intimidate. Uppy was crying. You see me turn or do anything like that. I'm just telling him to be quiet. I'll always mute my mic. Well, okay, maybe not always, but... Don't need unnecessary audio. Oh, I see an item right there. <laughs> He's being such a crybaby. A chesto berry. Hey. Aren't you a little toughy? That's me talking to my puppy. He's a little toughy. Raise or leave. <laughs> My puppy's name is Chopper, if anyone's curious. It's getting warm in this room. No bueno. Not too warm, though. Just a little bit. Ooh, I wonder if the Suns are winning. They are playing the Warriors, and they were getting spanked last time I checked. And, yep, yeah, they're still not doing great. That's for damn sure. Down by 18 points. Unacceptable. Ah. Uh... All right, Bryce. You got me some good XP, so I thank you. Mm. I guess we'll just keep running up Firo. Don't you dare patronize me. What? I didn't even... Why are you so offended? I, did, I literally didn't even say anything to you. Caitlyn. My goodness. Such... Such anger. I'm too much. Hmm. I guess so. Did we fight? Oh yeah, we did. Do do do. There, I'll speed it up a little. Catch up. Do 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 do. We'll fight you before we stop at that Pokemon Center. You always lose. Well, let's see what you're working with. Maybe, uh... Maybe there's a reason you're always losing, eh? Let's take a look. Pikachu? Really? That's your Pokemon? No shade on Pikachu. It's just, you know... Hasn't even evolved... Just this little mouse boy girl. It is a girl, technically, that this trainer owns. And a Clefairy. We'll go to Nido King. He's got brick, uh, brick Break. Okay, nice. My puppy's finally laying down, taking a sleepy boy nap. He's not just trying to eat his puppy pad and a towel that his water bowl's sitting on. <laughs> He's got a nice little bed, some blankies, and he's got a rope toy in there. It's a nice playpen. A really nice playpen. Heidi! Ah, oh, after all my training. Yeah, it didn't really pay off, did it? 
A cherry berry. Is there another one up here? Nope. Thought there'd be another trainer, maybe. All right, let's get to the goods. Do -do 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 -do. Oh, thank you so much. We hope to see you soon. All right, let me save real quick. Save game. Bada boom, bada bing. Turn off my mouse. Oh, bite, I've been looking for you. It's me. Uh, 20 species is supposed to give you. With the Everstone. Nope, no, uh, no 20 Pokemon. I hate to break it to you. Gotta get my cursor off my screen. It's gonna bug me. There we go. All right. This is where the fun begins. Rock Tunnel. Flash. Nice. Look at that. Look at that beauty. And now, the moment of repel, so we don't deal with a bunch of random ass Pokemon battles. Um, I don't like what you're gonna have, so let's throw out Nido King. Oh no 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 no! Throw out Nido King. Accidentally click dig. Just in case he's got um, I'm thinking he's gonna have like electric electric Pokemon. Oh, there's a repel. Or uh, poison. Or both. That's what these scientists like. Pokemon fight, ready, go! Ashton. Oh, a Cubone. Oh, he's a Pokemaniac. Okay, I see. I see. So we could have gotten away with uh, Gyarados or uh, Ivysaur. Yep, we're just gonna spam thrash. Oh, we got the critical hit. Nice. Level 25, Nido King. That's pretty cool. He's got a Q bone and a slow poke. All right. Doses. Game over. Yes. Game over indeed. All right. First ladder complete. Another Pokemaniac. I draw illustrations of Pokemon when I'm home. That's a random fun fact. Winston, what do you got? Ah, uh, yes, Slowpoke. Something I did not want to have to deal with, but yet here I am. Um, let's let's use Leer then Thrash. That's what I was afraid of. But luckily, it is just a Slowpoke. Okay. Ooh. Ooh. He can hit both of our dual types with uh, super effective moves. Oh, very nice. Very nice, Nido King. You done well. <laughs> I'm exhausted. How do you think your slowpoke feels, dude? Go ahead, use this. 42 points is pretty ideal. Ah, yes. The first repel has been used up. We gotta revive. Um, Picnicker. We'll use Firo. I don't often come here, but I will battle you. Dude. All these trainers just sitting in this fucking dark-ass tunnel. Pretty creepy. 
And we got a good pull with Firo. Very nice. Got to deal with Oddish. No problem. About to get 25. Ooh, Bulbasaur. Done. Just like that. Oh, I lost. Yes, you did. You have been yeeted. Another maniac. I think that's a maniac. Let's see what he has. We'll, uh... We'll match him with the Gyarados. Oh, I know about Pokemon cosplay. I do. Yes. Yes, I do. They are, uh... They are common in this world. Ooh, look at that. Good pull. Very good pull. It would have been Nido King or Gyarados. Either way, we would have been ready. Cubone! We can deal with that as well. No problem. Are we gonna get the one hit KO? Yes, we. Oh, we got a critical. No surprise there if it's gonna get taken down in one shot. Almost level 24 as well. Well, that's that. Yes. That is that, indeed. So I think there's a hiker on each side. My Pokemon techniques will leave you crying. Okay. We'll see. With your one Geodude. This man is over here threatening us with a singular Geodude. I mean, he must be confident. And just like that. Hiker Allen, I give. Yes, yes, give up and give me your monies. Aha, there he is. Hit me with your best shot. Fire away. Eric? Ah, yes, my chop. We will use water pulse, as always. I always wish that, um, as a Gyarados, like, if you kept the move Splash, it would have been cool if it, like, uh, enhanced your water attacks or something like that, you know. Why? I don't know. Just, just a little headcanon that I wish was true. We'll switch to Ivysaur. Get him a good little chunk of XP. Also, I like to balance my uh, my move usage so Gyarados doesn't run out of water pulses. Oh, Repel. Almost forgot. Almost, but didn't quite forget it. This tunnel goes a long way, kid. So I've heard. Especially when, uh, you don't have flash and you're just hugging the corners of everything. Gotta love it when they just send out an army of one Pokemon at you. And like I said, wanna balance out the usage. And realistically, we could even get Nido King involved with his uh with his brick break fighting. We'll always do wonders against the rock types. 29. What, what? Sweet scent. 
I don't need sweet scent. Appreciate you asking, though. Boom. All right, Lenny, you did good. And there's another hiker. Maybe I'm lost in here. Yeah, you definitely are. Onyx, some good XP. We'll take that right on up. We got the rock snake versus the water dragon or the water snake. You go both ways. Either way, they don't have arms or legs. <laughs> Another onyx, okay. If he has a third onyx, a third onyx, that would be great. I'll take that XP. Ding ding, 25, baby. Oh, there's Dragon Rage. We'll take that. That's 40 damage. Look at that. It always inflicts 40 damage. Well. Finally got rid of Splash. A Geodude, really? We're just gonna use Brick Break on you then. We're not even gonna waste our time with a Razor Leaf or a Water Pulse. And we could use Dig. I always thought it was interesting how Ground was super effective against Rock. Ease up, what am I doing? <laughs> I don't know, bro. What are you doing? An escape rope. What up, hiker? I just wanted... My pathing was wrong there. I meant to go above him just to see what was above him. And I was gonna battle him anyway. But I ended up running right into him. <laughs> yeah, slower the attack. We know the drill. Do 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 do. A graveler. That's cool. Shout out to Hiker Lucas. And we're already halfway through our moves with Water Pulse. Six hundred XP, very nice. Yes, give in to my power. Sure, our repel's about to wear off. Oh, uh, let's go up. And there's nothing there. Pretty cool, huh? Pretty cool stuff. Nothing down there. Okay. Switch out to Firo. And I'm going to save while I'm at it, because if we lost this progress, that would be disheartening. Do you know how you can avoid getting lost in the mountains? You can bend twigs as trail markers. Well, aren't you helpful? Do I look like I get lost, Sophia? Ah, Jigglypuff. A little beefcake. Oh, one hit KO. Nice. And a Pidgey. I guess we'll just use Thrash. Which will probably be an overkill. Like, just the reality of a Nidoking thrashing on a Pidgey. <laughs> yeah, you did that to yourself. Couldn't have done it. Yeah. 250 XP, basically. We'll just keep the thrash going. I don't see why not. 
Results gonna be the same. Yes, sir. Goodbye, Sophia. You did your best. Did you really, though? Honestly? Was that your best? A max ether? Very nice. Um, We'll switch to Ivysaur. Do -do 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 -do. Can you beat my power? Bruh. Can you beat mine? Doubt it. Truthfully doubt it. But yeah, we only use... This will be our fourth time using Razor Leaf. <laughs> Gyarados has been getting that love. Come on, give me another Graveler. I'll take an Onyx too, but a Graveler would be cool. I don't want three Geodudes. It's not that exciting. There it is. Hiker Dudley sending out Graveler. Outmuscled, yes, by a plant dinosaur. Ooh. Well, hopefully he doesn't have anything that puts our Ivysaur at a disadvantage. Awesome. The exact opposite. Now let's one-shot this baby. <laughs> yeah, definitely tired. Definitely tired. Think I'll have some popcorn, watch The Office. Feed the little man some dinner. Get him all tired for bed, and that'll be a night for me. Oh, level 30, what, what? Ding, ding, ding. We'll take it. And then we're basically at the end of the rock tunnel, which is cool. Um. Yeah, let's do Firo. Like I said, we want Firo to be strong for that fourth gym battle. Don't try anything funny in the dark. What is up with these... <laughs> Some of the dialogue, I tell you. <laughs> nice. Took care of you, no problem. Clefairy, okay. Do -do -do. Take care of you real quick as well. Nice. Very nice. Leah. Leia. Doo -doo. You have Pokemon. Let's start. Well, by all means. Uh, Ariana. Ariana. Whichever it is. Ah, uh, I hate... I, I'll never be a fan of the, uh... The low-leveled, weak Pokemon, like, just makes the battle take extra time, and we don't even get a lot of XP for it. But, I mean, if she's got four Pidgeys, okay, she doesn't. At least, when you add all of these, uh, little Pokemon up, we'll, we'll you know, we'll get around that 800 to a thousand experience by the end of the battle, but individually, it's just it's just boring. Uh, we like Leer. It helps with the Fury attack.
and little man's getting upset that I have spent 35 minutes away from him. Well, to be fair, it's been a little bit longer than that. I recorded a reaction for my Alphabite Reactions channel, and that was about 30 minutes as well, so... But, I took him out to go potty in between that video and this video, so... He's just bored. He's upset, he's in his playpen, which I don't blame him. Did my repel wear off? Okay, no it didn't. Aha! A pearl we can sell. The pearl. SpongeBob, I'd like you to meet me daughter. Hello, pole. <laughs> All right, Dana, what you got? Nothing crazy. Just a meow. Well, you had a meow. Not much longer, buddy, I promise. Just be patient. Just take a 20 minute nap, and you will be out of your playpen. We made it to the end. And that was Rock Tunnel, baby. But there's still some more trainers to battle. Okay, cool. He laid down. That's all we wanted. Carol. Picnicker. Carol. Get more comfy. Come on, give me four. I'll take three. Three's all we needed. Ooh, Pidgeotto. Ooh, you Gyarados. That Intimidate will be nice. That way we don't have to worry about taking too much damage. Pidgeotto can be can be tough, as uh, our rival has shown us. But nothing crazy. We can guarantee 40 damage, which is awesome. Look at that. Oh, Whirlwind? You're gonna split my XP, bro? That's... Awful. I was gonna do a... A Sleep Powder, but... Didn't need it. Big... Big difference in level. And he was almost dead. I'm too tired, I wasn't up for it. What a terrible, terrible excuse, I gotta say. I don't buy it. Ha 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 ha. <laughs> Just a crazy hiker laugh, huh? That's all you got for me, Clark? Probably in the next part, we're gonna have a Venusaur. He's getting pretty close. Not laughing. Okay. Whatever you say, buddy. And there should be one more trainer to battle, I'm pretty sure. The Nap Nap Berry, which backwards is very close to Banana. Okay, so maybe we have... Are you a trainer? Yeah, you are. Okay. So we got two more trainers. Slowpoke? Cubone, that works. Works for me, work for you guys. Do 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 do. And there's the slowpoke. See uh, how well the suns are doing.
Down by 15. All right. <laughs> hmm. Oh, I got to put the trash cans outside. It's Monday. I'll do that too. Add that to the list. I was like, I hear something out front, but that's the neighbors putting their trash cans out front. Oh, I missed. It's been a while. I wonder if he's going to survive because of that Harden. I want to say because there's a big difference. It might. Yeah. Okay. About to say, we got 11 levels on him. 11 levels. Excuse me. 50 attack. 58 special attack. Very nice. That's a good amount of XP. Onyx and Graveler. I ain't complaining. No, no, no. Not at all. Do, 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 do. All right. Now we can touch base in Lavender Town. Yep. Gonna do that real quick, of course. And I'm gonna save again because we've emerged and landed. Didn't even finish my sentence. We emerged from uh, the rock tunnel and we have arrived at Lavender Town. And because I am a greedy boy. Oh, uh, we're going to have to fight one of them, aren't we? Yep. What's a cute round of fluffy Pokemon? Well, we know what she's going to have. I was going to say, we're in the area where we can catch Growlithe. So we're going to go ahead and catch Growlithe after we beat this trainer. Oh, thank goodness. Didn't want to have to deal with uh, getting put to sleep, just delaying the inevitable. Well, tell you what, we're n we're gonna not have to deal with a two a two hit turn. All right, we're just gonna take you out with one move. Just like that. We defeated Julia. Um, let's switch to Firo. Actually, no, Ivysaur. Yeah, that'll be good. We can put Growlithe to sleep. Be easier to catch him. Do -do -do. All right, let's actually run into one. And there he is. 15 Growlithe. Yeah. But we're not, you know, we're not worried about hitting this thing. We're going to do our usual method. Oh my gosh. We're going to have to put him to sleep. No, not a Meowth. Come on. That's not cool. Oh. Why? Why did we have to run into Growlithe and then immediately uh, get roared away? And now... Well, now we're going to struggle to catch him. Or find him. Hmm. Come on now. There you are. It's a girl, Growlithe. But we'll take her. There we go. That's right. Stay asleep.
Let's see how lucky we can get. Not so much. Do I use the Great Ball? I think I will. What, what? Pretty hype. Pretty hype, if I do say so myself. Very friendly and faithful to people. It will try to repel enemies by barking and biting. We've seen that! It definitely repelled enemies by uh, barking. It roared right at us. Go ahead, do the usual. Doo -doo 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 -doo. Why, thank you so much. We'll throw Growlithe out front. Oops, did not mean to do that. What item do you have on you? An orange berry. That's cool. OCD at play here. Since you are an HM slave, you do not follow the rules of the party configuration. Let's see what this old man's got. I'm a rambling gaming dude. I thought he was about to say I'm a rambling gambling dude. <laughs> do, 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 do. Ah, a Growlithe of his own. Yep. Oh, do we not have Intimidate on this Growlithe? Flash fire powers up if hit by fire. <laughs> That's kind of a bummer. I might, uh... I might get a different Growlithe on my own time. So we don't have to burn up time in this video. Because I want... Intimidate! But, I mean, yeah, I think I will, because there's not- I would never have a Growlithe slash my Arcanine out if I'm facing a Fire-type, so... Yeah. We're not gonna level up this Growlithe, we're gonna catch a different one. I should have noticed when we ran into it that, uh, Intimidate wasn't immediately activated. Do I have to put you in the PC to let you go? I do. Alright, we'll do that real quick. There's our... beautiful Diglett. Yeah, go ahead. We'll just release them both. All right, be free again. That Diglett's like, you let me go in Lavender Town? <laughs> I sure did. Well, look who it is. A scientist. You should be informed, you need strategy to win at this. Alright. Well, I've got strategy and a strong Pokemon team. And there's the poison type. Ugh. Ugh, 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 ugh. Tell you what, probably not gonna record when I'm this tired again because my lord, it has been a struggle. Please don't use minimize. Please don't use minimize. And that's why we didn't want him to use minimize. Oh my gosh. 
Oh my gosh. This is just going to be great. We're going to have to hit him twice at the minimum to take down this thing. And he's going to be hard to even hit. Oh my gosh. And my dig was... you. I'm going to leech seed you to death. I will hit you once with leech seed and I will be happy. I don't care. Uh... Thank you. Thank you. And will you sleep powder now? Because that's... Yeah, I, I don't care. Awesome. Oh, do you know what would be good for this, though? Dragon Rage. We just gotta obviously land the hit, but... 40 damage. With Leech Seed stacked already. Pretty nice. We can rely on that. And Muck's gonna... He's gonna have some chunkiness to him, so... Yeah, I kinda figured. Kinda figured as much. Oh, there we go. Oh, nice. And then Leech Seed will finish him off. Okay, cool. Alright, so that worked out. That could have been a lot longer. But we got lucky hitting him. Yeah. These poison types, man. Specifically the, the Grimer Muck lineage. With that Minimize and then Acid Armor, it, it could be a long, drawn-out battle. Oh, goodness. Uh, come on, just hit him. Just hit him, Nido King. Hit him. Yes! Beautiful. I'm over here complaining about, like, a two, three-minute battle. <laughs> Listen, we're used to just sweeping teams, alright? What can I say? That's what we're used to. Ooh, a double battle! This is like one of the only double battles in the whole game. And we'll do this, Nido King Firo. And we'll shock you with our twin power. Hey, do you know you have a boat named after you? Eli and Anne. Brick break. Aerial ace. That's just... That is disgusting. You hear me? That is just disgusting. Like, my grandpa must have turned on the AC, because now... I'm feeling chilly. Our twin power. <laughs> yes, it has been thwarted. Ah, uh, that scientist. He scares me. I like Nidoran, so I collect them. I like Nidoran too. I've never really used Nido Queen though. I've never used the female Nidoran. I've always just used the Nido King. Because of the attack, let's be real. I know Nido Queen's more defensive based, but. Don't really have a need for defense when you're playing just the story. The way I play, personally. When it comes to team composition, I just like hitting hard. That is truthfully it. Now, does Need Arena already have the uh, the ground duel typing?
Huh. I think she just has the poison. Why, you ask? Because I wanted to win. Just like you. Meowth is so cute. Meow, meow, meow. Well. We know Brick Break's gonna get used. Alright. I guess a team of Meowth is what we're up against. She did say how cute she thought it was. So it only makes sense. Hey, we'll take level 28. We'll take it. Oh yeah. Do 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 do. We must look silly standing here like this. Yeah, at least one of you is aware of it, because you are not wrong. Ah, again, a bunch of weak Pokemon that we're just gonna have to deal with. Yep. Yep. That's what we got. Or that's what we got. And we will switch so we don't have to deal with the drawback of Thrash. <laughs> Is this going to be enough? Oh, wow. Congrats for surviving. Is this going to be enough for level 26, though? Sure is. We got it. Pikachu. That's disgusting. Yeah, we'll go with Ivysaur. Bada boom, bada bing. And a meow. Okay. All right. And we will fight the scientists for our last battle for the day I suppose school is fun but so are Pokemon yeah that's okay I can't agree with you about school being fun but the Pokemon part yeah coffee ooh sludge that's a nasty move oh duh all I gotta say is, duh. All right. Thank you, coughing. Thank you. Thank you for not letting me just end the battle as quick as possible. Pathetic. Fucking pathetic. Ah, good. Not only are we gonna be hitting ourselves, but we have the chance to miss. Great. Great. Okay, cool. Nice. 
Well, that worked out for me. <laughs> Leslie, huh? And then you've got someone down here. Oh, that's a biker. Good lord. Alright, well, we're gonna go ahead and heal up. And we will save. And like always, when you play an hour of Pokemon, you make a good chunk of progress. Like I said, in the in my own time, I'll catch another Growlithe and uh, make sure it has Intimidate next time around. But that's it for this video. We will uh, continue to head west and... Uh, We'll make our way through the Ghost Tower in Lavender Town after we beat all those trainers in that route we were just at. Uh, I appreciate everybody for tuning in. You already know how we do it around here. Until next time, y'all. Doses.